Hi Ken, so right now actually I have a 9x9 card case here for the testing on the Fuki 30 path through card. So right now for the input we have two Fuki 30 path through card and one is from this laptop and with the 1080p resolution and another one from this mini player which is can support the 4K resolution. So for the outputs, right now we have two outputs, one to the 4K TV and I one to the DVI monitor on the second TV. So right now actually we have the input one from the laptop switch to the two outputs but right now we only have the 4K TVs showing the image and also the audio. That means the signal is the DVI signal, uh, HDMI signal. Just because the DVI mount only supports the DVI signals. So if we're going to solve this issue and we'll need to copy the uh, EDID. Plus, and also we can see here the EDID key is flashing. That means this EDID is at the factory default setting. So our EDID default setting is the 1080p HDMI signal. So if you want to have the DVI monitor have the image, then we just plug up the source. Then we have this DVI monitor. Then connect to the input port. Then just because the EDI key were flashing, then we we'll just press the EDI key again. Then the EDI key indicator is stable. Then we can just plug out back to the output card. Plug back to the output card. Then have the source. Connect back. You can see right now we actually already have the two DVI monitors coming out with the Images, but right now the audio is only come out from the speaker of this laptop, it's not from the display. So right now we can have these two TVs with the image coming out. So right now for the for this one is with the 4K resolution, can you switch to the input two? Audio outputs. So we can check out the resolution. We can see it's right now it's actually 4K30. Uh, even though the EDK is still at the flash mode, then we can just disconnect this one. Then we have this one goes to this. Have the laptop source connect to the input two. Then we can see with the default EDID setting also saying we only got the 4K TVs showing out the images, but the DVM on is not. So now we have this 4K source connected to the input one, which we just set the DID copy from the DVI monitors. So we just have it connected, then we switch to the input one to all the outputs. Then we can have the image coming out to the 4K TV, but not the DVI monitor. But no audio coming up just because it's still the DVI signals. We can check out the resolution. It's still 4K30, then we can change the resolution of the input source. We change to 1080p 60 hertz. Come. 
confirm. So now it's the the resolution is 1080p 60 hertz. Then also we can have the image output to the DVI monitor. The resolution is 1080p 60. But it will know audio coming out just because it's still the DVI signals. Okay, so with the EDID factory setting mode, then we can have the full key source pass through, but we couldn't get the uh, we, we couldn't have the DVI signals. But with the copy the EDID from the DVI monitors, then we can have the DVI monitor to have the image coming out. Okay, thank you.